What's going on, Infinite Fam? Welcome back to another video. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, turn on your post notification bell, leave a positive comment down below for a chance to get a post notification shout out at the end of today's video. So guys, today I'm gonna be having my mom call Janice a gold digger. I feel like that's one of the worst things a mother-in-law can say to their daughter-in-law is that you're with my son for the money. And that is completely not true, guys. Janice is not even close to a gold digger. Everything we do, bills, when we go out, food, literally everything we do is 50-50 as we feel our relationship should be. But Janice is in the living room right now She's currently playing with Blooper. I have another camera already set up over there. I'm basically gonna walk over there and give my mom a casual phone call, you know, just catching up with her, see how she's doing. Oh, and by the way, my mom is completely in on this. So she's gonna ask me what we did last night and I'm gonna say, oh, we went to dinner and all this and that. And then somewhere down the line, she's gonna be like, oh, you know, who paid or, or Janice's gold digger. Every time you guys go out, you're always paying for something. And I just wanna see what's gonna be Janice's reaction when my mom says that over the phone. I feel like she's gonna get like really awkward about it and not really say much until I hang up. And then she's gonna question me as to why my mom would say something like that. I can't see Janice confronting my mom while I'm on the phone with her. I just don't see that happening. But either way, guys, if you guys are ready for today's video, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up button. Comment down below Team Isaiah all day, every day, and let's get into it. Babe, what do you want to do for lunch? Look at this mama's boy. What the heck was that? I was eating pomegranates. I just kicked the cup. What you want to do for lunch? I don't know. What's up, mom? What's going on? What you doing? Yeah, boy. Laundry, cooking, usual, Sunday. What you up to? Nothing. Trying to figure out what to get for lunch. Mm. Where did you go yesterday? I didn't even see you or hear from you. We had dinner last night. Um, we went to that steakhouse in uh, Paramus. Mm. Let me guess. You paid again? Did I pay again? Yeah. Yeah, I actually did. Why you say it like that? Because I feel like you're always paying. It almost feels like she's like a gold digger at one point or another. Why would you say she's a gold digger? Because when you ever hear about Janice paying for anything, and I mean anything. I'm not going to lie, you're kind of right now that I think about it. Ooh. I mean, I'm just stating the facts. That's all. I'm not trying to ruffle any feathers. She's she's giving me a look right now. Let me call you back. Bye. Bye. What the hell was that? <laughs> I don't know where she came out with that. Yeah, but you're sitting here agreeing. Now How I, is that true? She must notice something if she sees it. Like if she what says something mean? about it, she where must. First of all, we always do stuff 50 50. That's not fair. That is so not fair. Babe, I, I know. Believe me, I know. No, you don't, because you literally just agree with her. So you just like allowed her to just say that about me. A gold I just, digger? Seriously? I, I want her to think that I pay for most of the stuff. Why? That's so stupid. Now you have your mom. That's what that that's what a guy is supposed to do. I want her to think that I'm the one that pays for everything. So I don't know why she would call you a gold digger. Like yeah, that, that makes that me look word. so bad, and uh, the fact that your mom thinks that of me just makes me feel like pretty shitty, to be honest with you. I don't know. You don't know, but you're sitting I... here egging her on, like how that's fine. Even... What? How did I instead egg her of, on? Instead of defending me and saying, no, she actually does pay, we do 50-50 all the time. Instead of saying that, you're literally saying, oh, that's fine, like, oh, I agree. Who says stuff like that? I'm just... The amount of times that I pay for stuff... What the hell? That's not fair. The Babe. only time, the only time that you pay for stuff 100% is obviously when we're with your family because that's your family. But I feel like that's kind of just like oh. your thing. Like, of course, if we're with my family, out to eat with my family, okay. I'm going to pay for it too. Okay, but So that's the only side that she sees, so that's not fair. Okay, but why... Are you getting mad at me? She made the comment. Yeah, she made the comment, but you didn't defend me either. I'm just... That's not right at all. I don't see I don't how you see think how that you, that's okay. I don't see how you're more upset with me rather than I'm her. upset because, first of all, that's your mom. It's not my responsibility to make sure that she's like, thinks highly of me. Like, obviously, that's on but, you. I didn't do anything like for her to think that. I don't and know. Maybe I, it's and just, I think that if you would have said, like, nah, she actually pays 50 50, then she would be like, oh, my bad. But no, you like but try to make is, it seem like you see do that. pay. She doesn't see exactly. that. Exactly. She saying. doesn't but see listen, that. But listen, listen, I feel like it's just a coincidence that every time 
she asks like, oh, what did we do or did we go out and all that. I feel like it's just a coincidence that every time we did, I paid. I feel like it's just a coincidence. So I feel like, I don't know, I feel like you can't get mad at her for calling you a gold digger. How can I not get mad? Like, she could have said anything else. You literally call me a gold digger. Like, I'm with you just for your money. I never, ever, I mean, ever wanted your money. I've babe. always been an independent woman, get stuff on my own, pay for my own stuff. You never pay. Like, I never asked you to pay for anything for me. 100%. Everything you just said was facts. But, like I said, at the end of the day, we make the same money. Right? It don't matter. We it's make the same the money, that, but. That I'm viewed as a gold digger. For what? I don't care I don't what know. you got. Is, is there something that you might have said in front of her or done in front of her? That, no. Are you sure? Because I'm got, positive, hundred percent positive. Never will you ever catch me asking or like insinuating that I want somebody else to pay for me. That's my mom raised me so much better than that. Okay, but my like mom I said, to be independent. like I said, is there anything you might have said? Like when you guys are chilling, when you guys start chilling, I, I leave. You got, you know, I let y'all do things. I don't want to be around y'all. Never come up when I talk to your mom ever. So there's nothing you might have nothing. said or anything you might have nothing. done that would have made her think that you're a gold digger. No, nothing. Absolutely nothing. That's what I don't understand. Like, I always made sure, and you know, and I feel like now I feel like I need to just let her know. Like, no matter what, if I'm with you, if I'm by myself, single, if I'm with anybody, around anybody, I'm good. Babe, I, I know, financially I know. support myself. I know you don't. Irregardless, know, if we have the same money or not. Babe, I know this. I don't know why you're telling me this. I know. Because I feel like it's your responsibility. You want me to? Now. You want me to tell her everything you just told me? No, it's your responsibility to call your mom babe, and actually gotta, say, "No, we do stuff 50-50. I just babe, wanted to sell. No, 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 no. Babe, no, no, no. I'm not gonna fight your battles for you. If you wanna, what do you mean fight? If you wanna confront my mom, confront my mom. Call her and let her know how you feel, like woman to woman. I feel like that was just so out of pocket, but it's your place. Babe, like, it's like your I said, if you have a problem, something. if you got a problem, confront her about it. If if your dad would have said something to me like, "Oh, I feel like he's this and this and that," I'm not gonna be like, "Can you tell your dad that that's not true and I don't like that that he said that?" Like, I'm just it's gonna confront him. I'm gonna confront him man to man, very about, respectfully though. though. But that's not what I'm upset about though. What I'm upset about is the fact that. Like, if that conversation came up with my father so, or whatever, so you, and he says, oh, Isaiah is using you for your money, I'm not going to so be you're, like, you're yeah, mad. you're right. I'm going to be okay, like, you're right, you're right. I'm wrong, I'm wrong, I apologize. But that's I what I'm apologize. saying, like, to, you try to make yourself sound like, like, I apologize. Oh, I, 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 was, I, I was wrong for that, but at the end of the day, she still called you a gold digger, and I had nothing to do with that. I had nothing to do with But that. at the same time, I would have checked my, my dad, and I would have been like, yeah, but that's not true. Like, don't say that because that's not true. You only probably thinking that because you see this side. I get you what you're see, saying. You know I get what, I mean? what you're saying. I get what you're saying, but I'm built different. What does that even mean? I'm built different. Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> Why are you looking at me like that? <laughs> Babe, it's a prank. I called my mom. I told her to call you that. You know, I, you know dang well my mom would never, ever insult you like that. You guys is like this. You guys are closer than I am with her. That's what's sad. I, I, I made an intro. I called her. Well, I didn't call her. I texted her last night when we got back from dinner. I texted her. And I was like, listen, I'm going to do a prank tomorrow on Janice. I need you to call her a gold digger, basically. And she was just like, you were wrong for that, but okay. So she did it. See what I said? No. Come that on, yo. Come funny. on, man. I don't play with that stuff. Yo, like, I already I told ever. them. Babe, I already told the Infinite Fam, you're not a gold digger. You're nowhere near close to it. Everything we do in our relationship is 50 50, as we feel, we feel a relationship should be. It should be 50-50 everything, right? So I already told them that. You're nowhere near close to that. But you got to stay team Isaiah because that was a good one. No. Come on, bro. I need to let it be known. Wherever the camera is, I make my own money. I'm responsible for myself. Okay, I don't know what's bothering me more right now. The fact that there's a pomegranate cup with a spoon right there on the floor or the fact that this dog is just facing the couch and just completely okay with it. He's lounging. He got tired. Ripping. He's lounging. He was tanning over there, guys. He was yeah. getting his tan on. But come on, yo, say Team Isaiah, because, bruh, I, I put a lot of effort into this one. No. It wasn't really that much effort. But come on, yo. I was going to say, that just don't take months. Your mom put in the effort. Nah, yeah, my mom did all the work. <laughs> so I'm come on, yo, say it. I'm surprised she really said it. Say it. No. You're. God. All right, guys, so that is going to end today's video. You're still not going to say it, are you?
No, I'm You're never. You're such gonna a say salt it. bag, bro. You're I'm such not. a salt bag. I'm you just not. can't say it. No, I'm not. I'm just. Gonna oh get my to god! I be giving you credit. I give you credit all the time when it's due, and you just refuse to say Tima's because it. It's two is words. Not, uh, technically, this is not something you did. Your mom did it. So all right, but it was my idea. It was my idea. You know what? We're done with this. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure you guys smash that like button. It is time for today's post notification shout out. Today's post notification shout out goes out to Nikayla Armstrong. Shout out to you. Thank you so much for your love and support. If you guys want a post notification shout out, all you guys gotta do is like, comment, share, and subscribe, and turn your post notification bells on so you're notified whenever we post a new video. And we'll catch you in the next. And you have to comment down below, Team Isaiah, all day every day because if not, you're not getting a shout out. So with all that being said, we'll see you guys in the next video.